today I woke up not wanting to do anything but I have to go to Disneyland again because today is the second day of candlelight I didn't even come on here to update you guys I've been really really bad and I'm most likely yeah going to be combining some days just because I feel like I've been really boring and I just haven't been feeling like 100% so I do apologize about that but I'm going to open up my admin really quick because I should already be getting ready to go to candlelight and do it all over again it was really long very beautiful I loved it of course but it was just very long I got there at around like 1 something because check-in ends at 2 p.m and i was there until like 8 45 so yeah there was two shows one at 5 30 and i think one at 7 45 so let's look at number four for my nespresso advent calendar it's right here i just realized that we get this really big one on 24th so let's do number four is my lozio 7.77 fluid ounces so, so we'll get that brew in but first let's see what we have for our italian cookies we've been getting biscottis so let's see number four what's today let's see Ooh, so i get something different i was actually just guessing about the biscottis but i went ahead and looked at the back and chocolate or i did get chocolate and almond biscottis this ones are coffee flavored cookies no no this one's the limoncello flavored cookies Ooh, yummy okay so let me brew up my coffee and i'll probably just come back on here when i'm on my way yesterday i got some subway because because they only gave us snacks at disneyland and i mean like really small snacks so um i was really hungry yesterday and i ate my sandwich on the way so I think this time I will do a foot long and then eat like half of it before and then the other half in between shows just because I was still pretty hungry. So that's what I think I'll do today. But yeah, okay. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Right, I'm going to try this. It was pretty full in the cup so I just went ahead and added a little bit of oat milk and then some creamer. So let's see. Nice creamer. <laughs> it's not bad, but I think this would have been the perfect one to use the peppermint mocha creamer with just because there's like no taste to it. It's just like straight up just coffee. Mm. So good. Okay, perfect. So I am going to have this while I get ready. And I'll for sure see you guys. Just got to the parking and it's kind of sprinkling. So, does that mean the show gets canceled or not? If you guys don't know, we actually get like paid for performing at Candlelight. And I haven't done Candlelight, well, I, I've done it before. I've done it like twice or three times before. And they usually give you a park ticket like a disneyland ticket to come back another day but well they've changed a lot of things before it was only one night and now it's two nights and before they will let you in to the park after the show now they don't do that because if they would have done that i would have definitely gone into the park and filmed some footage and stuff like that but they don't do that anymore another difference that i know from some of like the alumni from my high school that i actually caught up with yesterday um was that the tickets they receive now are park hopper tickets and so since i'm performing two nights i'll be receiving two park hopper tickets so that's going to be great to come back with victor just wanted to mention that if you guys were wondering if we got like paid for it that's essentially how we're getting paid for the performances um but yeah before it was different they will only give you one ticket obviously because you would only perform one night and 
it was not a park hopper. It was only like a one park ticket. So yeah, okay, it's kind of sprinkling. It's kind of eh. We'll see, hopefully it gets better. I don't know if the performances will be canceled. I'm not sure. I guess I'll find out once I get there, but I'm gonna leave my camera here and try to take any footage, but it's like not permitted at all since they want to keep the magic going and I totally understand. So we'll see if I can get something. And if not, I'll just come back on here later. I'm sure tired. That's how I felt yesterday, but okay, gotta go. I'm running a little bit late. I did wake up late today because I got home late yesterday. I have to tell you guys all about what happened yesterday, but um, yeah, let's open up our calendars because I have to make my coffee and run out of here. <laughs> we are already on day five, which is right that over here. So let's see what day five brings us. Day five is for Tato. And that is five fluid ounces. And then for the cookie advent, let's see number five. Number five. Ooh, we have a little chocolate cookie. That is the cocoa and chocolate drops cookie. Perfect. Okay, let's brew this. Finally, up. uploading my day two and day three vlogmas video. I know, guys. I know. I just the days have just been a little bit boring, but that's why. But I got this package in the mail yesterday from Amazon, and you guys. These are so cute. I haven't been influenced by TikTok in a very long time because I've been very good about my budget, but I feel like this is going to come in handy, and it is because it's for food, breakfast <laughs> to be specific. But there are these cute little containers, and they almost look like canisters, honestly. But there are these cute glass with wooden cap containers. They're so cute, and look, it comes with a little wooden spoon that you put right there. How cute are these? Anyways, I saw some girl on TikTok using these for some different parfaits, so like yogurt, granola, and fruit parfaits, and that just sounds very yummy. So I thought I would pick these up and make some parfaits, so I think I'll end up going to the grocery store today to pick up some fruits because since I was at candlelight all weekend, I really wasn't able to go to the grocery store. So I have to go pick up some things. Victor is coming today because on our calendar today is our little Christmas shopping. So we're going to be shopping for some family members, mainly Victor's family members. But I also wanted to show you guys one thing. So. I am, I guess you can say sponsoring two kids, well, so far, from my job. So you guys know that I work at an elementary school. And so I'm actually really excited about this. And I was going to head out to my parents' house already, but let me tell you guys because I'm very, very excited about this. So I have these little two tags from the giving tree that they set up at the office at my elementary school. So as you guys can see, I will be, I guess, sponsoring two kids for Christmas. I'll be getting two kiddos some Christmas gifts. And um, I just wanted to have picked what I could relate to the most, I guess, as a child. I did pick two girls and I'll just show you guys. So one of them is a seven-year-old female and it says toy, choose one. And then it says dolls or kitchen toys. So then after that, it says wrap present and return to front office with tag tied on. And that's by Wednesday the 14th. And then the second one is a 12 year old girl. And for the toy, it says nail sets, hairband, or makeup. So I don't know, I just felt like those were the two that I geared towards. And I talked to Victor about it and he actually wanted to take part of it too. So I'll get a tag for him tomorrow. But I'm really, really excited about this. I've been wanting to do this for a long time, so I'm just like really happy that I'm 
working at an elementary school that does stuff like this so i'm really really excited so we're gonna go shopping for the girlies as well and maybe i'll look for some like small little things that i can give my kiddos at my job as well so yes all right <laughs> that's probably what we're going to end up doing later so this should be a more eventful day <laughs> than the past few days have been but if you guys have not checked out last my last vlogmas video i found a youtube channel that records all the candlelight shows like every single year and if you guys would like to go on there and check me out i am on there a couple of times um but yeah i'm, go I'm probably going to play that for my parents during like christmas day or something so that they can see because i really truly love the songs in the show they're so beautiful and i just truly love being a part of candlelight which i did mention that i got some sort of like payment from candlelight i want to show you guys my two disneyland tickets that i got as a form of payment so here they are got two tickets and these once again are one day park hoppers and they're valid from january 9th until december 14 of 2023 so yes happy about that although it was very long very very long yesterday was actually one of the hardest shows just because it did start to sprinkle and they had to delay the show by like an hour so i got home really really late but yeah i just wanted to update you guys about that and now let's go to work right, so i'm done here at my parents but i wanted to show you guys their cute little decorations well, first is like the whole neighborhood is like all decorated, especially like back there. But look at how cute my parents. <laughs> I think this is literally the cutest thing ever. I love it. Okay, so back home, <laughs> Victor's here. Victor thinks that he's in the vlog too much because he. He's been in one of the <laughs> vlog based videos, so he's like, it's already too much. They're probably tired of me, but yeah. So Victor's here, and we're gonna go. Like huh? I'm here again. <laughs> <laughs> You're here again, and we're going to go Christmas shopping. Yeah. My Ruby comes back tonight. She just informed me. <laughs> I actually didn't know when she was coming back, but she's coming back tonight. Um. But yeah, so tell them where we're going and what um, we're gonna get. What are our plans? So first we are going to Target. Okay. We're going to Target to get just some things. So um <clears throat> like for the stockings and stuff, right? Yeah, so I want like stocking stuffers and I actually haven't like I haven't stepped the foot in a Target in a long time. Um <laughs> because I don't want to like overspend and stuff and I just I don't know I just haven't really gone I haven't really had time so I really I really haven't seen what they have for Christmas and this is Victor's first year stuffing stockings right right which is something that me and my sister do like every single year so he wants to join in on the fun now and then where else are we going mm, well first there uh stocking stuff and then just like we've kind of already been buying gifts like right for like our families and yeah stuff. but just like other little details that we think we might need yeah um and then we're going to home goods oh yeah we're going to home goods why because well i already told them um oh. about the gifts for the kids right. so we're gonna go look for those things today because i have to i have to wrap them and give them back by next week i think or two weeks from now on the 14th so yeah Next week. yes and then if we have time i made a grocery list but i don't know if we'll have time i would like to go at least for like fruit and then we have because i just bulb. don't have any and <laughs> i was watching the video today um when we had boba and i really want boba now so we might get boba let's see <laughs> Hopefully my sister's back um, from work and maybe we can get boba with her. But yeah. All right. Sounds like fun. And it's 8.15. Okay, gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> so this is how our cart looks so far. I'm getting stocking stuffers for my family and then 
Got some cute little things for the kids at school. And then this for like the party. These trays. And then Vader's gonna bring the worst. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Look at Victor run. <laughs> so I'm here the next day and I'm ready to do a little haul for you guys. I will be adding this to the end of yesterday's vlog, which is today's vlog for you guys. I hope that makes sense, but I, just, I didn't want to go without showing you guys all that we got from Target. We got a lot of stuff, um, so let's get started. All right, so first off, these were just things that I got for like home. I got some cocoa pebbles. I've been really liking this with milk. I know it's not the best for you, but yeah. I got some of these Simply Cheetos, the white cheddar kind. I also got Doritos. I don't know why. I really just wanted Doritos with like Tapatio. It just seemed really good. I was hungry when I went to Target, as you guys can tell. Then I got these mini raisin, these vanilla yogurt cover raisins. I was thinking I could have some, but also include these in the little bags I plan on giving my kids at school for Christmas. And then I wanted to get a trail mix, so I got this one, the monster one. And they had the big bag, but I just decided to get the little packages so I could take these to work. These tissue papers, just because I always need tissue paper, especially for the holidays, so I just thought I would just get it now. Then Victor wanted to get himself a stocking because he doesn't have one, so he thought this one was a classy one. Very classy for my classy man. <laughs> and then he got us this popcorn mix trio. It has caramel, white cheddar, and butter popcorn. Because he knows I love popcorn. The real present we got, um, this is for one of the kids I'm sponsoring, but I wanted to get them um, well, actually, Victor showed me this. It's a bakery, like Barbie. So it has a dollar there and a bunch of little cute bakery items as well as some dough. So I thought she would have a blast playing with this. So I got her that. The Christmas, like, friendmas party I'm hosting at my place, which I don't think I mentioned, but I am hosting that with my friends. I got some things, some candy canes for the candy cane game as well as i think i will be giving some of these to my kids some napkins because i already have some similar ones from last year so i just added to those some cute little honeycomb little trees super cute and then some of these trays there's two in here these were five dollars a piece but these are little serving dishes i thought it would be nice to put maybe like little nuts or stuff so people can just eat while they wait for like the food and stuff so yeah got some of these these are all the stocking stuffers we got so this is what victor bought this is actually for me and it's so funny that we got like stuff for our own stocking but all of this on this side well these these and some of these ring pops and they have all this at target i'm pretty sure you guys know they have a target by you but I plan on giving these to my kids at school. We actually had to do an activity with jelly beans and they, they've loved jelly beans since then. So I got them this little pack. I have eight kiddos. So I will get some of these ring pops, add some jelly beans. I got some little Hershey chocolates. These little baggies I thought were super cute. They're little Danta treat bags. And this, this came with eight for I think $5. Then this is for the other stocking. So usually I'll stuff my sisters, my brother-in-law, Joel, my brother, Andrew, and now Victor. So I got some of these little Tic Tacs. I got this, these pens for Victor, as well as this chocolate, these trees for the stockings. I always get M&Ms and the Kinder Joy little eggs. And that is all that we got from Target. A lot of stuff, but I hope you enjoyed. And... Also, let me know if you put anything specific in the stockings because I'm always looking for stocking stuffer ideas. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys tomorrow.